What's happening, guys? Cowboy here, and we're ready to continue on with higher education. So, uh... First and foremost, it's gonna be interesting to make our way back, because we need to head on over to the main point over there. And it's night, and I have my grappling hook on for mobility, which means no UV light. Thankfully, it's a nice short, quick run, and we're already there. So that helps considerably. Get up to that? No, we cannot. Um, yeah, I soon realized after the fact that um, where I had gone over at, um, you know, Dude's Place, the fucking bullshit gunsmith that didn't even offer me anything of value, that it wasn't an actual, like, technically it was a safe zone, but it wasn't, like, a real safe zone. Like, I couldn't, you know, rest or anything there. The only thing I could do is, uh... Where the hell is the... In here? Need some new gear. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so you're the... You're the trade guy. Here's a police rifle for you, And a bunch more. And some sickle that I don't want. And some throwing axes that I don't want. And you can have my valuables. And I have a lot of freaking money. Um, I also have, don't want a pickaxe. You can take that. Uh, let's see, Iron Hatchet, pretty good damage on that. American 9mm pistol, I think the other pistol had higher damage, which is disappointing. 300, damn. 349, damn. Some real high-end shit. I think I want the other pistol. I don't really need a weapon, I got machetes for days. I mean, in fact, I got, um, two cork machetes to work with for now. I could just go all cork machetes, but I like my hunter's machete a lot. Actually, you know what? I do want to make a... What was it? I wanted to make that new thing. The, uh, the angel sword. So I need a machete or a blade. And you don't have... you. I could get that or the premium saber. That saber would be badass if I was at rank 16, but I'm not... So the best you have for making that would be a panga machete, which I'm not going to waste anything on, so... Screw you, and I'm going to go up and find out what this captured transmission is all about. No matter how many times I watch it, I still can't believe it. An internal global relief effort document surfaced today that, if verified, implicates the GRE in a far-reaching criminal conspiracy. Instead of trying to find a cure for the Haran virus, according to the file, the GRE had plans to weaponize it and sell it to the highest bidder. Worldwide backlash has... No, no, skip to the important bit. I was the last survivor left to the quarantine. I can't believe I made it out. I can't believe I'm still alive. We mourn all those who didn't survive. But as the president said in a speech here earlier today, life is for the living. Military troops have searched for survivors all over the quarantine, but now there's no one left besides the infected. According to Colonel Tanner, once his decontamination process is finished, the infection will be completely obliterated. Ministry did this. <laughs> They're making their excuses to the rest of the world for destroying a city. Look, Crane, before you go charging out of here, we already had an idea of how to send a message. We were going to plant explosives in a building and set off fires in a pattern, something the zombies could never do. Trouble is, we got a runner, Michael, over to the right building, but he can't get through to the top floors. Too many biters. As much as I can handle that. Admit it, none of the rest of us are strong enough to do this job. Well, we've got to do something right fucking now, or you, me, Jade, and everybody else are going to get blown to bits. I tell Michael I'm on my way. And while I'm doing that, can you get in touch with Jade? Try to get her to meet me. You have my word. <clears throat> right. Meet with Michael in the sewers. Ooh, oh boy, that is far for a night run. Alright guys, so after a brief foray of uh, trying to go meet up with Michael at night, 
I quickly discovered that running night solo in the area that I'm in now is basically fucking suicide. Um, depending on the length of the video, I may actually leave the very brief attempt to survive at night in the video. We'll see. Um, largely depends how long it takes to meet up with Michael and get this public face thing kicked off, but uh, in short, it basically involved me dying near instantly. Like, I ran, I uh, saw a quest pop up that looked interesting and involved a special gun, which uh, you can see right here, legless spider, and I get the anti-gatoid gun. No idea what that is, but whatever, it sounds cool. And uh, promptly got my ass molested by like eight volatiles at the same time. So yeah, needless to say, not a fun time. Oh, oh no, I actually do want to go down there. Excuse me. I am going down into the sewer. So let's go meet up with Michael, start some fires. I gotta find Michael. Whatever the embers have in mind, if it stands any chance of working, I, I've got to make it happen. It's crazy to think, if they didn't drop Crane in here, everyone probably would have just blown the fuck up. Hi. Power. Okay. Sturdiness three or takedown. Sneak behind enemies and silently kill them. I really like the sound of that, but I think I want sturdiness three. I mean, damage absorption. Yes, that's that's always a plus. Um, it does look like I'm going down through here. That would be a completely different level of bullshit to put up with. those will lead me to him. Michael? Michael, buddy? I'm here. I'm your badass zombie killing support. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Let's, let's not, uh, not go all zombie mode just yet. The fuck haven't I gotten any antis in? I thought you were a biter. Why you gotta sneak up on a guy like that? Jesus, you almost gave me a heart attack. I didn't mean to scare you, Michael. Okay, ooh, okay. Troy said you were on your way. God, I'm glad she didn't see me jump like that. She'd never take me seriously. You got a little crush, huh? How could I not? Have you met her? That's why I volunteered for this. Wait, so you're risking your life with a horde of flesh-eating zombies to impress a girl? Mate, before the outbreak, the most impressive thing I'd ever done was win a spelling bee, okay? Troy would have never even looked at me, so I'll take my opportunities where I can. All right, fair enough. Tell me what needs to happen here. Uh, well, okay, um, I tried to finish the job, but I couldn't get past the ninth floor. All right, leave it to me. What needs to happen is you take these explosives, turn on the gas ovens, and plant charges in a few specific apartments. Well, that'll make a pattern, huh? One nobody outside Haran could mistake as random. If they can explain this shit away, we are all going to be really fucking impressed. Now, if you're ready, your first stop is on the 10th floor. Zombie killing spree! Oh. I 
I got plenty of cork machetes to use. Well, I got two. So, tenth floor. Zero. Not like I really need lockpick. Floor one. Oh, it looks like I'm going into floor one. Something tells me this isn't the kind of uh, time you would use an elevator. <laughs> Can I see? What the? Damn it! Something must have blocked this shaft. Seriously, dude, just get some fucking antis in. They gotta have some somewhere. But he said he couldn't clear the ninth floor, and that's where I'm at. Floor now. I'm on the tenth floor. Great. Look for apartments 105, 106, 134, and 137. This is supposed to be a big enough bomb to fucking wreck all of these things, and it's basically useless. Why did I make so many of these again? That's right, there's shrapnel bombs too. They're not gonna do shit. I'm just using these things up. I don't even care at this point. Actually, you know what? I'm not even gonna fucking waste my time with them. Put my flares in place of those. Use the, uh, my throwing stars on. Those actually get the job done. That's it. Come here. Come here. All of you assholes. You're all dead. I'm tired of this. Fuck over here. Fuck you. Fuck you. Stoves. 
Okay, I'm done with the first apartment. Good work. Get to the next one. That's right. Okay, so it should be the kitchen for all of them. Kitchen, 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 kitchen. Kitchen, kitchen. Stokes. All right, second apartment's done. Damn, you're better at this shit than I am. Next you need... Oh, shit. What's wrong? Michael! I've got some company here. I'll oh, get back, you bastards. Michael, get out of there. Get to safety. No, I can hold him off. You've got to finish the job. I'm not going anywhere until this is done. One thirty-four, one thirty-seven, thirteenth floor. Oh, fucking asshole! Damn it! I was so busy cleaving my way through everything, I didn't even expect an exploder. Son of a bitch. Fucking empty kitchen. There were two exploders, I'll be damned. Just to be safe. Let me get a camoed up. That way, in case I have another exploder accidentally walk up on me, it's not insta kaboom. Fuck that thing. Okay, all done. Great, and uh, if you could get back down here, I wouldn't turn down a helping hand at this point. Alright guys, so after running around for a bit there, um, I found out I'm not going all the way down to floor 9, but I actually had to go to the elevator shaft on floor 10, which makes absolutely no fucking sense, you know, because we originally went to, uh, oh, we went down to, uh, you know, floor 9, and then we climbed up through the hole in the floor to reach floor 10, and I'm guessing that's, uh, our buddy. 
Oh no, that was just the guy that was stuck in the mine shaft. That's not Michael. Never mind. Shit. That was only five floors. You're fine. Dealing with more exploder okay. bullshit. I hope you're all right, Michael. Six is the magic number to kill those assholes. Give it a second here, and we'll be on our way. Oh my god, come on, really? the detonator now. Let's see what this is all about. It's gonna say like help us or something obvious I think. Maybe they would just draw a big penis. That would be awesome. That's what I would want to do. In the city. It's just a big, uh, sad face. Jade, we see it. Great job. Thanks. I hope it's enough. You had any contact with Jade? Crane. Jade, J is that you? Crane, I heard what you did. I see what you did. So, do you believe me now that I'm on your side? Oh, sons of 
bitches. Wow. Wow. If you're really on our side, you've got to contact the GRE. They must stop the Ministry from bombing the city. Look, I know, but I lost my one and only way to reach them. Guys, listen. Savvy's figured out a way to break through the jamming. He just needs your help to do it. Okay, Jade, you heard that? We have to meet. Yeah. All right. Meet me in that red building on Emerald Canal. We'll go from there. And Crane, be careful. The infected here are even more ferocious than the ones in the slums. Yeah, I kind of, uh... Oh, shit! Where the fuck did you come from? Dude just was like, boop! Hi there. Sewer safe zone, quartermaster. Safe zone, meet with Jade. Alright, let's head on over to Jade. It's about to be nighttime, so I'm getting the fuck out of here. I think technically it already is night. Let me check the time here. Time? No, it's about to be night in like a couple seconds. We are into a safe zone. Very nice. Well, either way, guys, we are wrapped up for now. Obviously, those dickheads just straight up fucked all the work I just did, which pisses me off. Uh, I'm also kind of confused why we, you know, we went up to floor 9 and then climbed out, went to floor 10, and then went back down from floor 10. So that kind of sent me for a loop a bit, which is obviously why I cut all that footage. But either way, we are done for now. And up next, we have Rendezvous. So make sure to stay tuned. We'll catch you guys then when we meet up with Jane and make some progress.